Number one is Airbag, which is the first song on Radiohead's OK Computer, which was released in May 1997. Around this time, there was a lot of interest in electronic music about Daft Punk's homework came out in January 1997. There was crossover between rock and dance music. The Chemical Brothers slash Noel Gallagher single Setting Sun was released in 1996. Regarding the genesis of OK Computer, Tom York said, I started blindly buying all this stuff from Warp Records and inevitably getting into Aphex Twin and all this stuff and wanting to buy synthesizers. Portishead's 1994 album Dummy, which combines sophisticated rock music with atmospheric samples and breakbeats, was also surely an influence on OK Computer. The opening riff of Airbag is kind of guitar hero, but it's also orchestral. The guitar track is doubled by a cello sound from a Mellotron keyboard. And there's also sleigh bells. It's called Airbag. Don't the sleigh bells just fit in really well with the album's white and blue art scheme? It's like snow. And later it's layered with echoey atmospheric guitar arpeggios. The drumming on the song is great, slightly staccato and offbeat. Drummer Phil Selway credited DJ Shadow as an influence on Airbag's drum part. When the beat kicks in, it is Phil Selway's playing, but sampled and sequenced through an Akai S3200 sampler. In Rolling Stone's oral history of OK Computer, producer Nigel Godrich said it took Tom York and Phil a day and a half to program the various parts. Then they mixed it through guitarist Johnny's pedal board to add distortion, delay and all sorts of shit, which results in the at times crunchy, at times chirpy quality of the drums throughout. The song itself is great, Tom York is indeed back to save the universe. At 3 minutes and 33 seconds, you have this amazing guitar meltdown. It becomes hard to tell if you're listening to guitar sounds or sequenced electronic music. This slowly ends as the declarative opening riff returns, backed by York's choral singing, closing the loop and ending the song perfectly. I remember hearing somewhere that Tom York cried the first time that he heard the final mix of Airbag. The great thing about this song is that it manages to combine guitar heroics and great songwriting with elements of electronic music, such as the sampled and sequenced drum beat, the use of synthesizers, and the electro freak out breakdown that we have towards the end of the song. On top of all that, there's just the quality of the production, how all the tracks come together to create a cohesive and highly atmospheric whole. The song was originally called Last Night an Airbag Saved My Life, 
a reference to in deep's 1982 hit last night a dj saved my life arguably a dj or electronic music in general did save radiohead from the excesses and pitfalls of guitar music in the mid 90s number one is climbing up the walls the zero seven remix In the mid to late 90s, electronic music was particularly interesting and progressive. Those involved in electronic music at this time were totally immersed in DJ culture, record collecting culture, and they had been their whole lives. So you had people like Daft Punk, The Chemical Brothers, The Prodigy, Fatboy Slim, Portishead, The Avalanches, Groove Armada, and zero seven around this time there were some interesting crossovers happening for example the chemical brawlers and noel gallagher setting sun and let forever be and Radiohead's work with Uncle and Zero Seven. And that's where we find this track. All music describes Zero Seven as a down-tempo European outfit. Fair enough. Zero Seven are made up of producers Henry Benz and Sam Hardacre. The music that they came up with for this remix is remarkable. It's like it's from some lost, pristine European thriller soundtrack. The music works really well to highlight Tom York's haunting and beautiful vocals, perhaps even better than the original song. Don't get me wrong, climbing up the walls from OK Computer is brilliant, but there's a lot going on in that song. The remix creates a wide, snowy, ultramarine canvas for the vocals, so you can really appreciate Tom's nightmare lullaby. This remix is a real hidden gem. <laughs> 